All right, hey, what is going on guys? Dwayne Gibson here and welcome to Gibson's Beard Adventures. And on my channel, you're gonna find some beard product reviews. I do some beard mail and unboxings now and again and also been doing some stop motion stuff, stop motion interviews with some of these beard companies we know and love. So make sure y'all hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell so you can get updated every time I post a new video. So for today's review, it is going to be of Kingsman Beard Club. All right. So, watch this little intro. And we'll get right into it. It kind of has a, it's kind of like a Jersey Club. Thing is a adventure review series where I go out on location. Y'all are back. How'd you enjoy that little intro? So, today's review. Kingsman Beard Club. Okay, I got three scents. One is an oil. And I got two bombs. Okay, we'll go ahead and talk about this oil here. Which is... The Holy Grail. All right, now, the ingredients are listed on here. It's going to be hard to see because of the black and gold lettering in my camera. So I'll go ahead and read these off here for you, and that is grapeseed oil, sweet almond oil, clear jojoba seed oil, and authentic oud essential oils. Now, for nobody who doesn't know what oud is, which I don't know by now how you couldn't, but oud is made from a moldy old tree over in Asia. So that's basically a breakdown of it, but it has a really fantastic, phenomenal scent. Okay, oud is very sought after and it's very, very expensive. And the fact that he's got authentic oud essential oils in here is something to be reckoned with. Okay, the Holy Grail Beard Oil retails on the website right now for $24.99. And the rest of his oils are $19.99. Now, I'll tell you just a little bit why this one's more expensive. Uh, Kingsman imports their oud essential oils straight from Cambodia, and it's just it's really really expensive. Uh, for the first two years that Kingsman was in business, I was told that they actually lost money until they were able to gain enough sales to get a business loan to be able to buy more in quantity. So I thought that was really, really awesome that he was able to take that and be able to work it out to where we can get this same fantastic scent in a beard oil. So absolutely awesome. Oh. And I don't know how else to describe this. Anybody Now, I've heard people say that this would remind them like of a Catholic church, things like that. So I don't know. But all I know is this is a fantastic scent that I think any guy should have on their beard shelf. Um, feeling beard. Might as well. I can't forget about that. It's got a great feeling beard, y'all. Uh, it soaks in great. It is a light medium oil. And the scent duration on this Holy Grail is 10 plus hours. It's absolutely phenomenal. And it is a bit strong. So if you're not into the real strong scents, this may not be for you. But I personally absolutely love it. Now to go over their bombs here. I'll show you here in the bigger tin. Okay. This is a nice white 
Sorry about this lighting, y'all. Nice light white beard balm, smooth. Okay, comes out, comes right out. All right, and it, it melts down super easy. It is a light hold conditioning beard balm. Uh, the ingredients on that, I do believe, is their carrier blend. And it's got cocoa, uh, cocoa butter, shea butter, and beeswax. And it offers a nice light conditioning hold. It really helps to lock in the moisture. Um, now, the scent that was on this one, this is The Wizard, which I don't believe is available anymore. And I just have the balm here, which is mm, it's blueberries and thyme, which has this nice... Uh, uh, fruity spicy kick to it really really nice now the other one I have here is the chainmail beard balm all right all same consistency now the scent on this is supposed to be a uh, refreshing citrus blend Okay, it reminds me of Fruity Pebbles. <laughs> I'm just saying, it, that's what it reminds me of. It reminds me of like Fruity Pebbles or a Fruity Cereal. Mm, it's really, really nice. Uh, scent duration on this, uh, for the balm here, uh, probably about maybe two, two and a half, three hours, something like that. Uh, it's not a very long-lasting scent on the balm. I don't know about the oil because I don't have the oil. And for the wizard, if he ever does decide to bring it back, uh, this is a about a six-hour scent on just the bomb being able to still smell it in beard. Uh, it, all day great feeling beard. So I give all this from Kingsman five out of five flames on my fire scale. Hope you all are enjoying these reviews and until next time have a good one live every day as an adventure